All right, welcome back to Guitar Navort, and here we go again with another Boss Tone Studio Katana tutorial. Today I'm only going to take probably about five minutes and just uh, show you how to upload a TSL file to either uh, a Facebook um, patch page, or if you know how to upload a file, it's pretty easy. Um, some people don't know how to upload it to Facebook. I'm, I'm going to show them how to do that. Or you can even send a TSL file over uh, Messenger, and I'm going to piss my son off and uh, double send him something I've already sent him. Anyway, in Tone Studio, uh, I've got this uh, uh, Metallica set uh, loaded right now, but it doesn't have to be loaded if you want to uh, save the file. You just come over here to this little Upload File button, hit that and it's going to say select live set so i'm going to come down here and i'm going to hit metallica and i'm going to save it to file and it's going to ask me if i want to save it again because as you can see it's already saved right there we're going to hit save again and i'm going to overwrite it all right now that it's overwritten i'm going to come down here of course i closed everything out but that's okay katana patch central great place to get files so once you've joined this group, or if you're already in this group, you come over to the files uh, area, and you're gonna want to uh, upload file, and it's gonna you're gonna say something about it, something about it, something about it. yeah, I don't know what the hell I just typed, but then you're gonna choose file, and you're gonna find that file that you just created, and you're gonna click open, and it's gonna go right there. So you type some illiterate stuff in there like I did. And then you hit save. I'm not going to save it because there's no point in doing that. It's not there. But once you hit that save button, you go back home um, to the top of the page, to the top of the group, and it'll be right there, and it'll show your file. And then people will, start be, will be able to see that file and upload it directly from their feed, uh, or they can search the files for it. Now, if you want to uh, send it to somebody... You go up here. Oh, I gotta go back over here. Here and down here, you get this little uh, paper clip thing. Looks like an attachment. And you can uh, attach it. I'm gonna attach a different one. I'm gonna send him a different one. Uh, it's more of a Pantera patch. And I'm just gonna hit enter. And as you see, it's going, going, gone. And it's that easy. And we're not even three minutes in. And I'll show you how to do that. So we can minimize that again. And you can do that with anything. Um, any of them. It's that easy. So if, if I wasn't very clear about something, you know, just ask in the comments below. And I'll do my best to address the question or clarify what I did. Uh, that's it. I hope this video has been helpful. Thanks for watching. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Uh, I don't care much about notifications because I don't do notifications on subscriptions myself because I don't need a notification every five minutes for every video that gets uploaded to YouTube. It's kind of crazy. But I would appreciate it if you subscribed and uh, I can make more of these videos. And uh, until next time, we'll see you.